Hello everyone. Our today's topic is farm animals. We will be learning about what are the two main types of animals? What are farm animals? How are farm animals useful for us? And so on. There are two types of animals that is wild and domestic. Wild animals. Some animals are wild. It is those animals that live in natural environment like forest, mountains, desert, etc. These animals live on their own and do not depend on humans for anything and are hard to be tamed. Some of these wild animals are dangerous too. We can see some wild animals in the zoo in our cities. Examples of wild animals Some of the wild animals are lions, elephants, bears, snakes, etc. Can you think of any other wild animal? Domestic animals Some animals are domestic, that is, they are kept in the house or farms by humans for either companionship as pets, such as cats, dogs, and parrots or for getting some kind of benefit from them like guarding or giving milk, meat, etc. such as dogs, cows and goats. Does any of you have a pet animal at home? Opposed to wild animals, domestic animals can easily be tamed and depend on humans for their food, shelter and general care. Domestic animals are very helpful to humans on the farm too. Some animals like horses, donkeys, and camels are used for transportation. Some animals such as cows, buffaloes, camels, and goats are used to get milk and meat. We get eggs and meat from chickens and ducks. We get wool from sheep and leather from cows and goats which are used to make clothes, bags and shoes. Cows and buffaloes are also used by farmers to plow the farmland. In Muslim countries, cows, buffaloes, goats and sheep are also farmed in large quantities as sacrificial animals for the annual event of Eid ul Adha. Dogs on the farm are responsible for guarding the farm animals. On the farm, these animals are often kept in large wooden buildings called barns along with stocks of animals fodder, grains, hay, etc. Since 
the domestic animals are dependent on us for everything and they give us so many benefits we should take very good care of them by providing them with proper food shelter and healthy environment we should not put too much burden on them and should not make them work too hard we hope now you have learned about the farm animals and their benefits if some concepts are not clear then replay the video again and again still if you have some questions then ask your teacher